darling, I'm home. I'm so sorry for leaving you all alone for so long. Where are you? I think I can hear you in the kitchen. Oh, there you are. <laughs> I missed you so much. <laughs> Give me a hug, come on. <laughs> oh, I hate going away on business trips. I could barely stand the normal working day, and then I have to go away for weeks on end without seeing your beautiful face. I don't care if it was only three days this time. It was still too long without seeing you. It doesn't matter that we face cold every night, either. It's not like I was able to hold you. I want to give you kisses all the time, but then work is so annoying. Ugh, the only good part of it means I can spend money on you. Every other part of it just sucks. I wish working didn't exist. If I could just shower you in everything you deserve without having to leave you for part of the day, that would be the ideal life. <sighs> I'm back now, though, and I'm not letting you out of my arms. You made my favourite for dinner? Uh, mm, mm, fine, I will let you go just for that. But then afterwards, we're sitting on the couch and hugging all night, okay? And we're watching all of your favourite movies. Oh, don't take that tone with me. <sighs> Fine, I'll sit up at the table like a good girl. But you have to promise that we'll do what I said after. <laughs> good. You already have a chair pulled out for me? Oh, you're such a sweetheart. I'm so glad you're mine. <laughs> I'm not overreacting. How could anybody not be charmed by such a romantic display? Especially from you, darling. You just have that magic touch that makes everything ten times better. Ten times more romantic. Ten times more... Uh, Alright, sorry, sorry, okay, I'll stop. But only because I get to eat your cooking. <laughs> Thank you very much, darling. <laughs> it looks even better than normal. What did you do this time? Did you change the plating? Did you add something to change the colour? It's the same as usual? Ah, it must be the long wait to have your cooking again then. Thank you for the food. Ah, it's delicious! Oh, I wish I could eat this every day. You really need to stop spicing up the menu, love. Oh, but if that's what you want, then go right ahead. I'm not going to stop you, obviously. <laughs> oh, I love staring at your face from across the table. You look so cute when your cheeks are all puffed and full of food. It reminds me when I first caught you. You were so... mischievous, refusing to eat anything I cooked for you. I had to force the food into your mouth. You look like a little hamster, trying not to swallow. I'm glad you're not misbehaving like that anymore. I was really worried, you know. I thought you were going to pass out all the time from how thin you was. And it wasn't like I could take you to a doctor. Uh, it was so annoying that your family had ties to the police back where we used to live. Well, we have several hundreds of miles away from there now. So it's not like we have to worry about anything. Even if the police around here did catch wind of what was going on, it isn't like you'd tell them anything, right? Right, darling. <laughs> That's what I thought. After all, you've earned my trust enough not to have to wear the GPS collar anymore. Oh, it was so annoying having that around your neck. It made hugs so uncomfortable. Not that I would ever mind hugging you. Even if touching you set my body on fire, I never deny a hug from you. I want you always. Speaking of which, though, you didn't have to leave the house, did you? I made sure that the online shopping had everything that you needed. Did you even notice the little gifts I put in for you? Huh? You 
returned them. Oh, you thought they got mixed up with someone else's order. Dear, you should have known I'd get stuff like that for you. I love to spoil you. How could you not think of it? You didn't want to waste my hard-earned money. Oh, you're always saying this. Don't buy me gifts, darling. I don't want you to spend your money on me. I want you to save it for yourself. You really need to let that all act up. It makes it so hard to be around you sometimes when all I want to do is shower you in gifts. It's not like you'll get anything else out of me. Well, maybe a new house eventually. I've got quite a few savings right now, even after spoiling you so much. I want us to live in a huge house. When we have kids, they'll be running around the halls. <laughs> I could come back to you, holding them in one arm. Maybe another child wrapped around your leg. Oh, isn't that the perfect sight? Hmm? Uh, sorry, am I talking too far into the future? Well, maybe one day. <laughs> A girl can dream, right? Thank you for the food, dear. Now, again, I am very sorry I was home late. And I know we literally just had a conversation about not spoiling you. But there's a reason I was late back. And it wasn't because my co-workers were being annoying again. Uh, it should be in here somewhere. Here you go. Alright, here's the first one. Ta-da! It's an apology gift. I know I freaked out on you too much before I left on my trip because of that game. I just couldn't stand you looking at that character with such loving eyes, you know? I should have just been for me. But, uh, like you said, it was just a game character. And it's not like you've ever strayed, or even attempted to run away in the past few years. So I have no reason to doubt you. So, yeah, that's my fault. But I'm sorry for destroying the game cartridge. But I managed to get my hands on the limited edition one, got all the trading cards of all the characters in the game, and it's got not one, but two posters. And I think there's even a special mode in the game. Though you might have to check that out yourself. Oh, was it a code? Sorry. I didn't really look too much into it. I just wanted to make up for what I did. I really am sorry. So, you know, you can play it again. <laughs> I, I know you won't be able to get back your old save file. I, I know, I know, that's why I'm trying to make up for it. Please don't still be angry with me. I, I promise, I will never do it again. Even if I get really super duper mad in how you're looking at a character in the game, or even how much you're fanning over the voice actor, I, I swear I won't fall off the hinge. Please. I... I don't want you upset at me. I, I don't want you upset at me. You're not? You're not angry at me anymore? You want me to watch you play? Uh, I don't know about that, darling. That might not be the best idea. After all, watching you play was what got me angry in the first place. If... If I'm going to get used to you fawning over characters... I should watch you to get used to it. But darling, that's going to be torture for me. You can't, you can't do this to me, please. I can't, I can't better look, I can't better let you look at other people with those eyes. Payback? Are you really being this mean to me? I, I, 
I guess it is only fair, since this is all you get to do. Okay, but... Gaming instead of the movies? But... <sighs> Fine. Okay. I'll, I'll let it... I'll, we can... Just a few minutes tonight. We can't the character's bio. Uh... Okay. Fine. R right now? But I have other- <laughs> Why are you being so mean to me today? Are you annoyed that I was gone for so long? What was that? Did you say you wanted me to be gone longer? Hmm? Oh, you said it's not like I was gone for longer? <laughs> That's a relief, but uh, okay, fine. We can look at their bio. But after that, we are only watching movies, and it's just going to be me cuddling you, okay? No video game character can ever cuddle you. I'm the one who's got their arms around you. I I'm your girlfriend, okay? Actually, should I? Okay, okay, I'll stop thinking about the future. I, I won't think about proposals right now. Let's just... Uh, let's just get this over with. I don't even get what you see in that character. I mean, really, what do they have that I can't offer? I get we don't look exactly the same. But I could dye my hair for you. I don't even mind saving up for surgery if it's that much of an issue. I... Ugh, fine. I won't... I won't talk like that. I know it's bad. I know you don't like it, but... I mean, look at them. Am I really inferior to them? What do you mean it's not a matter of inferiority? Different preferences? You're telling me you're not that jealous and you're telling me a matter of preferences. You've already got that look in your eyes when you're looking at them. I don't even think you've looked at me like that all night. No, you haven't. I can promise you 100% you have not. Okay, maybe you have a little, but why does that attention have to go on to them? Huh? Okay, okay, I did promise. A stupid like. I know I have the same likes as them, that doesn't make it any better. It's like you're replacing me with a digital copy, even. Mm, okay, fine, they have decent likes. Yes, okay, fine, I agree with their dislikes as well, but that doesn't make this any better. Get to- I, I do not want to get to know this character. I- well, I know I will if, if I'm going to be watching you play the game the rest of the time, but... Should I- I really shouldn't have bought you this game, should I? No, you're right, I should have, I should have. Oh, why don't they have a nice voice? I can't take it. Hug me. Really? Okay, at least just let me hug you if you have to scroll. Mm. Hey, tell me, whose face is prettier? Theirs or mine? It's mine, right? It's definitely mine, right? I mean, obviously, out of all of us here, yours is definitely the prettiest face of them all. I mean, it's not like even... <laughs> Okay, I'll shut up. Oh, oh, 
thank god that bio was really short. Uh, I'm sorry. I told you I was gonna freak out and that was immediately the first thing I did. wasn't cute. I can tell when you're lying. I had to deal with that during the transitionary period where you pretended to be mine. <sighs> it's so nice that you don't usually lie to me anymore. Okay, before you go into anything else, I do have one gift left for you. Here. Yes, it's a figurine of the character. I was just going to give it to you when, when I, after I gave you the game as a second sorry, but... Well, you kind of dragged me over here before I could, and then I saw the face on the screen and then I got angry, but... That's beside the point. Here. Yeah. Actually, I want one more kiss. And then I'll give it to you. <laughs> Here. Well, considering I got a hug and a kiss from you right now. Two kisses. I suppose I can learn to live with this character. I didn't expect them to be so similar to me, though. You like them because they're like me? Oh, I really have been an idiot, haven't I? I promise you going forward, I won't be like that anymore. And I really do mean it this time. So... Oh, you know what? Let's just continue playing the game now. We can move movie night to tomorrow. I... well... <sighs> yes, I'm not entirely sure I'll be fine. But it's for you. I'd do anything for you. You know that. I love you, darling.